sequence, converting recru recursive and explicit forms of arithmetic sequences. Okay, so here we're giving two parts. We're giving what the uh, first number is. It's going to start at uh, negative 19. We see that the distance here, or actually the rule here, is plus 6. So we think of more of it as a rule. Just think of it as a rule that could be a positive or a negative number here. So this is our beginning number here because the g of 1, that's the first number, and then of the sequence, and then our rule is plus 6 because what's ever after parentheses. And then we simply go n minus 1. So in this case here, we go to explicit formula. We're taking these two parts here and merging them together into one formula, one level. So again, you want to start off with the uh, negative 19. Since our rule is right here, so we're adding 6. That's our rule. And then we want to finish up with n minus 1. So we're always going to use n minus 1 in these formulas here. Now we just have one level and we want to take this uh, level here, this one formula, and break it into two parts. So the first part here, this is my first part number of the sequence. So the first number of the sequence is 25. The next part, this negative 49 represents what my rule is. My rule can be a positive number or my rule can be a negative number. In this case, it is a negative number. So here we simply type in 25. Here we simply type in negative 49. Again, the plus sign is there by default. You've got to put in the negative 49. Next question. We're going to take these two levels here and put it into one formula. So the very first sequence is 0. So we can type in 0. Our distance here is a positive 2. Then we can go n minus 1. Now you could probably add 0 plus 2, put it in there, and then put down your n minus 1. But I tell you what, I'm going to keep it the way it's in the formula. So I'm going to keep the actual structure. So I'm going to keep it as the first term, which is 0. The rule is positive 2. And then I'm going to go parentheses n minus 1. OK, now we have one level here. We want to break this into two individual levels here. So this is my first number of the sequence. And the number after it is my rule. So my first number in the sequence is 93. My rule is positive 4. So I'm going to type in 93. And my rule is a positive 4. And remember, the plus sign is there by default. Okay. 